Now, our next guest was in one of the most popular and successful sitcoms ever made. He was loved by millions as Ross Geller in Friends, and alongside Monica, Phoebe, Chandler, Rachel and Joey, had us in stitches for an incredible ten years. He's here today to tell us about his new project as a director, but before we find out about that, let's have a little trip down memory lane. Please welcome David Schwimmer. <laughs> you have. Hello. Does this follow you. you around the world? Does everybody no, want to be I your wish, friend? I wish this audience could come with me everywhere I go. I'm sure you are sick to the back teeth of talking about friends, but it still lives on in this country. In fact, it's still run all over the world. Do you think that, that Ross will outlive you? Um, I don't know. It's a good question. I, I've been thinking about it recently because now I'm a dad and I have a, a seven-week-old girl. Oh. And I was thinking, yeah, it's great. And um, I was thinking recently, well, that's going to be fun in 10, 14 years to, to show her that, that show for the first time. I think that'll be... I hopefully, you know, uh, I'll have the DVDs if it's still not on the air, so we'll but see. But you did enjoy your whole ten years, did you? Oh, yeah, it was great. It was the best job. Uh, do, do you ever. miss it, though, now? No, <laughs> No. I mean, I, I think sometimes I miss that, um, that rehearsal process. The and that camaraderie. Right? Yeah, and the, yeah. the spirit of collaboration between the actors and the writers mm -hmm. um, on show night in particular, because we do it in front of a live audience like this, and if a joke didn't land for some reason, we'd immediately, everyone would immediately huddle. I came and shadowed and, an episode of Friends, and oh, you're did absolutely you? right. I couldn't believe how quickly you all went, not funny, <laughs> zoom, a, a, a whole crowd came out, blah, 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 blah. five minutes later, you're hilarious. It, well, and, and a lot of the credit goes to these writers. They've, over ten years, they they, they kept um, hiring new blood and fresh, fresh ideas. And but he was and always the butt of the joke, Ross, wasn't he? Did you, did you mind playing the kind of the stooge in that respect? No, I mean, I, uh, you know, it really, it, it. Sometimes I think that's the most fun. I think, I think great comedy comes from pain. And, yeah. um, well, he was painful at times. Yeah, <laughs> and, and uh, I certainly could identify that with with that. I mean, there was a time in my life, especially high school, those years between you know 13 and 17, that were so awkward and painful. And I think uh, everyone can really identify with that. But um, had you done much comedy before Friends? Because that pratfall you did then was just right. brilliant, perfect oh. comedy timing and everything. Cheers. Um, yeah, no, I, I had done some, but not a lot. Um, I I went to uh, Northwestern University in Chicago, and we, you know, we were it was doing uh, serious acting and and training in Chekhov and Shakespeare and right. Ibsen and Shaw, and um, and I hadn't done a lot of comedy actually, and I was doing mostly dramatic work, and then suddenly got that that show and um, and thought, oh, I guess I I can be physical. I, I mean it. It was funny because my it, it was my mom actually who later when she saw the show and saw me doing some physical comedy reminded me because I would totally forgotten that that's actually what I started doing when I was eight nine ten years old <laughs> to make her laugh I would literally throw myself downstairs <gasps> or or bounce that's off extreme or throwing yourself downstairs. I know I would just be bouncing off furniture constantly <laughs> no. you know like dum, dum, you know and, <laughs> So, um, so I, yeah, I, I Can I ask you, that. will, will friends ever reunite or will there be a film? I don't think so. You know, I'm, you know, a lot of people have asked about that and I think, I think the truth is I, I really loved how the show ended. I, yeah. I felt it ended in the right, on the right note and I can't, I personally can't think of a really good reason to come back. To come back you all uh, other still than, see each other. You all still mates. You know, um, again, the truth is, I we see each other individually. Like I'm, I, I probably see Matt LeBlanc the most, mm -hmm. but um, I live in New York.